What's up guys? It's 2.30 and it is the day before Missouri rifle season. Slade asked me if I wanted to go bow hunting. I got off work early and Slade has been hunting a pretty big deer. He's only seen it once but um, they saw it last year and then he saw it this year and the weather it was like 70 degrees on Thursday and it's like 25 30 degrees right now northwest wind and it's right before rifle season so we're gonna give it one last go before everyone comes into deer camp and try to get it done with a bow so I'm just filming tonight Slade has hunted this spot uh, the last couple days and hasn't seen them but the weather hadn't been great so we're hoping the weather um, will help us get this buck tonight and if we get this buck it'll be one of the coolest hunts I've ever been on so stay tuned we're gonna climb up in the stand and hopefully it happens so Chadwick yeah what's up boy what's up gonna hit the bow stand one last time well good luck before World War three starts tomorrow <laughs> To it. Yeah. Oh yeah. Well, have fun. We yeah. will. We'll see Stay you in a couple. Up. We'll see you in a couple hours. All right.
eight to ten different box. Um, they're just one anything that was like noticeably big, I guess. We had a, a real nice eight pointer come out, and then when it got dark, there was one that was right on the border. Um, but it just there wasn't anything that was real mature and real big. So gun season starts tomorrow, like I said. We're headed back. Everybody's in camp. We're gonna have chili and some beer and play some poker. So all around gonna be a fun day, fun weekend, and uh, hopefully you'll watch us get a buck in the next couple of days. Stay tuned. What's up, everybody? It's opening day deer season for Missouri. Just got done with the pre-party to deer camp last night, played a little poker and lost all our money to Ethan's dad. Me and Slater getting ready to go to the woods, sit down, he's got a real big nine on camera. If we get it, I'll show some trail cam pics if he's kind enough to give them to me. But yeah, first time out really for deer season. Ethan and I have been so busy, but we're hoping to get it done tonight or today. So. We'll see you in the blind.
Hit him again, hit him again. Good shot. I broke my back. What do you mean by that? You my broke back is broken. What, a, a vertebrae or, or well, what portion? Spinal. I've hit him four times. Yep. Dude, dude, you got him. <laughs> He's down. I can see his antlers. He's down. Oh <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Saying, let's get the hell out of here, <laughs> dude. You hit him all five times. <laughs> oh. Is he getting back up? Where's he at? I see his antlers. I think he's dying, dude. He's dying. What do you think? This thing's a giant. Get in, go get it. And you got it on film, hey. Mm -hmm. You filmed this whole thing. Bryce did. This guy right here. <laughs> Just say it like you were, like you're talking to me. Just say, I, uh, me and my buddy were bow hunting. Cause I explained some of it yesterday, and I'll include some of that footage. Yeah. So I would say why you shot him four times. <laughs> some. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably got ten he pounds of lead hurt. in him now. You ready? Yeah. Stop. What's today's date? 12. Oh. Opening day deer season. Ready? Yeah. November 12th, what we thought was a big nine, finally hit the ground. Um, been chasing him with my bow. I actually took a picture of him a couple weeks ago on my way in. Um, me and Ethan went last night for uh, one more chance with a bow. Didn't get it done. Bryce came in with me this morning. Um, Saw a bunch of does, some couple smaller bucks, did some rattling, some grunting. Um, then I'll let Bryce tell the rest. <laughs> yeah, we, like Slade said, we just got done like rattling and grunting 20 minutes ago. I don't know if that affected him coming in or not, but we were getting right. Look over there. See him on the timber. But yeah, Slade just got done rattling probably 20 minutes ago. And he said hop up and look to the left because in that blind it doesn't have a window out to the left and I peeked up over the door and saw him and another buck walking right down the field and told Slade to get ready and picked up the camera and sure enough they showed up at like 50, 60 yards and Slade shot them four times. Kind of just kept wearing them. Yeah, the thing wouldn't go down. Like it, the first shot, like he like hit him good and Absolute just, freak of nature. <laughs> yeah, I don't even know if I would have wanted to shoot this deer with a bow because like it probably just wore it and think you're ran right. for three miles and you never found the thing. It's so tough. But Slade, did you have your fingers crossed all morning? Hold on. Hey, thank the rest of history. Hey. All right, well, that was weird. Um, well, what do you want to do? That's good. All right, Slade just notched his tag, um, and that's kind of the end of the whole story. Uh, they weren't too worried about filming anything after it, and they knew I'd be here, so, um, I did my job, did my part. Yeah, they got the shot, 
and uh, we're going to go back to deer camp and eat some biscuits and gravy and hunt a little bit more. But All right, we'll see you on the next one.